guys, um, right here they just finished, um, pretty much take, they take like a, a culture test, that's what it's called, and they have to, um, catheterize her because, you know, she won't, she's not gonna land. So they have to like put this little tube inside of her and um, urine comes from it. And she also has to have um, one taken out from her incision, which is here, because uh, urine comes out of there. So um, she was crying a lot. She was not happy, but now we got to calm her down. And they couldn't get the urine from this side with the little tube. Um, for some reason, it's kind of weird. So they ended up putting like a little baggie. I don't know if you guys can, can kind of see it. And um, they're tr they're hoping like they they collect enough urine from the actual incision so they can test it. Because her urine, guys, when um when she has a UTI, her urine smells really strong. Kind of like you guys know how like um when doggies pee, their their, their urine's like really yellow, and it just smells really strong. That's kind of how hers smells like. It smells bad, um because you know because of the kidneys. So, um, you know, this time around, she, I mean, her eyes are a little bit, um, hollow. Like, I, that's how I can know when she has a UTI, like, her eyes are kind of hollow. And when I lay her down, she, she's, like, in a little bit of pain. Um, I mean, every parent knows their kids kind of thing. So, it, like, for her to, like, cry randomly is not normal for me. So, when, when I see the combination of her eyes and then her urine smells bad and then her having those little pains i know it's like she's going through another uti so hopefully um you know uh we get to get a culture test from her urologist we are in the urologist's office right now and we don't have to um go to the hospital because um i've always taken her to the hospital like when i noticed that she's going through a uti but her symptoms like she's like really active she's happy and everything and before the other times um she's just really like she looks really tired really sad like she doesn't look like good you know but she's still looking like healthy active happy it's just like her symptoms that i can visually see and smell so um i was like okay maybe she doesn't have to go to the hospital because it's not us bad you know but if i see that she gets like a fever or something then i'm automatically taking her but um here we are waiting they put a little light on her because they had to see like and say hi hello hello <laughs> you're so happy oh my gosh so they weighed her and she weighs 17 pounds you guys she's so big she's six months already so she just turned six months like um almost a week ago and she's just so <laughs> look, oh my goodness, you look just like your daddy, so funny. Everybody keeps telling us that she's starting to look a lot like Matt. Um, just Matt, like, she, like they all look like him in like different ways, but her, I don't know, it's just like his exact twin, her eyes, her like face, like her hair, especially now because he has short hair. It's so funny, like, it's just super funny. <laughs> Um, after, after this, we have another appointment with her pediatrician to um, update her six-month vaccine and, and then see what they tell us. So let's see what they say. Okay, I just arrived to her pediatrician, which, which is really far from where her urologist is. It's like a almost a 40 minute drive it's really far i'm really tired we were there for like two hours because it was very hard for them to get the urine from the little incision hole so it's it's always very tiring and i'm hungry i didn't get to stop um and get lunch right now but it's okay i have my green tea it really helps me with my um uh, hunger appetite so we're about to go in her pediatric which is close to the it's actually right behind the hospital that we live by and um yeah she's a really cool dr bonnie i totally recommend her if you're in vegas uh, her name is uh bonnie tafoya she's like super nice super professional and um i just love her um so yeah we're about to go in there uh she's taking a nap right now and then we're going to give her her six month vaccine so hopefully she's not too bad at me let's go 
Okay, so um, our pediatrician <laughs> checked her. She said she's doing so good. She's growing well. And that uh, we're going to get her shots in a little bit. So it's time to do this. Yeah, look at the Yeah, my little rainbow. Yeah, my little rainbow. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So we are going to go i am literally in real life mom life morning life right now um i woke up early as you can see i'm wearing my shirt i was wearing it yesterday for the crazy doctor appointments and i'm just going to show you how i kind of just clean up fast forward all this because it can get very messy with four kids and four dogs and three puppies in this house so let's get to the cleaning 